Half away from seven, it is 30 years today since Greenpeace ship the Rainbow Warrior was sunk by French Secret Service agents in Auckland Harbour, claiming one life. The ship now lies on an artificial reef in Matauri Bay in Northland and has become one of the country's premier dive sites and one of the top ten dive sites globally. So what is this piece of New Zealand history really like now and how popular is the wreck 30 years on? Dive instructor Sam Jupe joins me. Sam, good morning to you. Good morning, Paul. Thanks for coming in. Um, how good is it? How good is it as a dive? Oh, it's an amazing dive. It's, well, like you said, it's, it's got to be rated for one of the top 10 dives in the world for a reason. It's, yeah, it's fantastic. It's super colourful. Um, I think the best thing is, is just the depth on it. It's um, super accessible to. Because we're talking about, is, am I right saying about 27 metres? Well, it's, it's under 30 metres? Like maximum 20, 26, 27 metres to the sand, but the main deck is like 17 metres, so it's within easy recreational limits. Yeah, yeah. All right, talk us through it, because even although I, I think about 10,000 people a year dive yep. on the Rainbow yep. Warrior, most people, overwhelming number of people, will never dive on it. What is it like to dive? Talk me through the dive. Um, it's, a, it's a very clean, easy dive. There's no current, um, and it's generally really good visibility and a huge amount of fish life on it. Um, I think that's one of the, the big things about it. There's a lot of fish life and very colourful. Um, the wreck itself, actually, um, it sits relatively upright, but it has a, has a slight lean on it, so one side gets a lot lot more light than the other yeah. um, and, the, and the other side is a lot darker so you get quite different growth on either side. Um, and so there's a, there is a lot of marine life living on and I suppose in yeah. the Rainbow Warrior. Yeah, yeah, of course and around. I mean that, that wreck itself um, is fully fully grown into that grown into that spot yeah. and it's, so it's like it's not on a reef it is a reef it is it, it's, it's made its own own reef its own ecosystem um, and in, in quite a cool way it's it's Making making what they've spent so what many years. Yeah, what they set out to yeah, do. No, set right. out to do. Yeah. And yeah. obviously, it's uh, it's a tragic, tragic, tragic situation that's happened with them. Um, but it's been given back to the sea. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's yeah. So when you dive on it, how safe is it to dive into the Rainbow Warrior? Um, we never recommend diving into the wreck itself. Yeah, um, you unless can I, do it, you, can't you? You can do it. It is, it is in that sense that you can always see an exit in there, but without proper training, you, you don't really yeah. want to be going there. But diving around, you can look through all the holes. Um, you used to be able to see the, the bomb hole, um, and you can look look in, like like we can see on the video, um, you can see all through it without right, without, 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 thing, without having, having to go in. To, without having to yeah, go yeah, in. Yeah, yeah, because that is a dangerous but yeah. uh, dangerous thing to do. Um, I understand that it's very popular with international divers, and perhaps ironically, because of its backstory, it's very popular with French divers. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I'd, I'd probably say around eighty percent of the divers that we take uh, are international. It is one of those international dives, and for most divers around the world, it's one of those ones people want to tick off off their list because people do want to know the backstory. Do you find when you're taking people there, it's more than just just the fact that it's a fantastic dive and a great reef. It is the backstory that gives it an edge. Yeah, yeah, of course. Any dive with a good story, um, people want to go and go and explore and understand and see see where the bomb went, went off. Yeah. Um, yeah, and I think with especially with the French, it's in a, in a way a bit of a pilgrimage for for it's become for the a dive. Bit of a pilgrimage, yeah, 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 absolutely, yeah. absolutely. Brilliant, Sam. Thank you so much for coming in. When no are you problem. heading back? You've been there many, many times. Um, I probably had up in about two or three weeks. Right. Yeah. Oh, she's a bit, a bit cold at the oh, moment. Can we get a bit soft? No, on no, us? no. <laughs> what do you mean getting a bit soft? I was born soft. Um, Sam, thanks so much for coming no in. Dive instructor Sam Jupe.